And joining us by phone from the capital city of Santiago is Paul Simons, the U.S. ambassador to Chile. Mr. Ambassador, good evening to you. Uh, good evening. Again, you're in Santiago, about 200 miles from the epicenter of the quake. Tell us, what did you see? What did you hear? Well, at about uh, 3.30 this morning, there was a rather uh, pounding noise, and uh, clearly we were going into a major shake. It was definitely uh, an emotional experience, I think, for, for anyone uh, who went through it. And we're happy to report tonight that you are doing fine. want people to know that. Uh, let me ask you, what are you hearing? What is the extent of damage, not only where you are, but also near the epicenter? The building stock here, the building stock, is all very, very uh, earthquake uh, resistant. So you didn't see any large buildings crumble, schools crumble. Uh, really, uh, most of the, the damage that was done was in older adobe-type structures or infrastructure, uh, bridges that uh, were weakened or separated. So the damage was really uh, spread out. This is definitely not a Haiti situation uh, by no means, even though the, the earthquake perhaps was stronger than in Haiti, the, the housing stock. Uh, the level of preparedness uh, is uh, totally different here, and Chile uh, has demonstrated, I think, in the first uh, 18 hours of this crisis, uh, you know, a remarkable uh, ability to bounce back. Okay. Ambassador Paul Simons, U.S. Ambassador to Chile, joining us this evening from Santiago. You take care, sir. Thank you very much for speaking with us. Thank you.